So the computer science field is changing astonishingly quickly. I mean, nowadays you could just tell an AI to code your own website. Now, of course, you should still learn how to code. Uh, I feel like it would be necessary for the future of humanity, especially to understand AI. We can't tell where this technology is going to progress and who will take control of it. And that's the scary part. My name is Caleb Aguiar, and I'm majoring in computer science. Yeah. Good? I do. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Using the mic my boss gave me. I stole it from him. You're like saying this on camera. <laughs> he knows. Happiness. There you go. No, it's just wanting to continue learning, the drive, the motivation to learn something new almost every day. It's exciting, it's hard, but over time it's gonna become a lot easier because learning should be fun, I think. The help and assistance that I'd get by having a uh, advisor that's also a professor in computer science, so that's pretty helpful to me. I get advice from a computer science professor. problem that I'd like to solve is something that's really selfish. So give my life meaning, sort of. Because right now I'm just a student, and when I'm not a student, what do I do? I have a job, right? What am I looking for in that job? Do I want to stay at that job? Is that what my life's purpose is? I guess through computer science and being creative, I'd like to find a life's purpose, sort of. That's my own problem. <laughs> As cliche and as Disney-like as that sounds. Yeah, there you go. I think it's made me very indecisive <laughs> with what I want to do in the future, but knowing that you can switch majors and minors on a whim, technically by taking different classes, is in a way chaotic, but comforting at the same time. Because you're not locked in. You're not locked in too something you don't want to be in. Um, but at Trinity, you can switch it up, try to figure out what you want to do in life. Having that freedom is liberating. The cool thing about computer science is that it's it can work anywhere. So I usually code on my laptop because that's the one that I take to class every single day. Here is just, it's just kind of there for studying at the moment, gaming, um, uh, video editing, some 3D artwork, stuff like that. It's just there to, uh, I guess, give me comfort uh, because I'm not far away from home, but I'm definitely not home. If you're incredibly indecisive, don't worry. You'll eventually figure it out. It'll probably take two years, three years, but you'll get there for sure. And when you finally know, your brain is gonna explode, all right? It's gonna feel great. But the moment until you get there, that little gap, it's gonna be probably the worst years of your life. That's just how life is. But man, you're gonna get out of there for sure.